Hey Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Arise, and welcome to Live, Laugh, Love, Tarot. Today's topic is Valentine's Day and the weekend prior to Valentine's Day. Okay, remember that this could play out past, present, or future, all right? Uh, this is a collective reading, so take it how it resonates, if it resonates for you. You can always check out my playlist for additional collective reads. And I want to say thank you so very much for all of the likes, subscribes, tips, and donations to this channel. is greatly appreciated. So for starters, I'm going to delve into my bag. I have words and phrases here. We're going to get the overall energy of this read for starting out for the weekend of Valentine's Day. Valentine's Day. Okay, so you got a nice little amount here. Okay, so we have understanding. Okay, and going well. So you're understanding a process that's taking place and you're allowing this process to take place. I feel like you've studied a situation um, and you've gained that understanding or you've gained that lesson, okay? And now you're placing your intent. Hmm. Intent to surrender this is that willingness like intent your intent to allow things to happen moving towards the light going in better situations this is um yeah with acceptance here right now aquarius you're just accepting things as they come you've learned to understand things this way and allow things and to just go with the flow allowing things to take place whatever happens happens type of energy contentment you're like yeah i'm thankful i'm content you know either way here we have death i feel like you really learned a lesson like had to go within you know when you learned this lesson okay um you had to go within to get this support it's like um uh, prayers answered by angels and ancestors that's assisting you of course in the divine first and foremost but there's an energy of you allowing things to just take shape into your life around this time there is some intimacy that you can expect to take place during this time it says let go and flow so an opportunity may present itself and you're being called to just kind of go with the flow don't blame this person hmm here we have feel it so don't make it seem wow don't make it seem like you don't want this person to or if you do type of energy i'll just kind of go with the flow it's saying wake up you know, so seize the opportunity, I guess, as it comes in. Encouragement, you may get a sign and be encouraged to pursue this. And then warmth, because this person may give you a lot of warmth. You may get a lot of love and affection through this scenario. Hmm, that's interesting. Let's delve a little further. I want to know what is Aquarius's thoughts during this time, please and thank you. Okay, bottom deck is all in the golden afternoon, inspiration, creative spark, imagination, conception. Be mindful because you could get pregnant or you could get someone else pregnant. You are very fertile right now. Impossible things, working through disbelief, imaginative leaps, fresh perspective. So it's like, oh, you're being inspired to have this fresh perspective here when it comes to this person and this situation. It says life is brief, bright, beautiful, and yours to live. So you're living in the moment, okay? And it says investigate, look closely, ask questions, and think before acting. So you're being very rational during this time when this person comes in to your energy, okay? After going with the flow for some time here with like not forcing a situation maybe some of you already know this person okay and you are just kind of you know going with the flow taking it slow and i feel like an opportunity is going to present itself 
for intimacy and warmth. And I feel like you're thinking about um, still questioning and dying all your eyes, crossing all your T's, but at the same time, being in this easy going energy and just going with the flow. We also have awareness. So your awareness is very heightened right now. Okay. Ooh. So you may be, hold on, let me grab these cards. You may be um overburdened damn near like you know how like a lot of good things happen to you and you just need time to like take it all in that's the energy that i'm getting for you aquarius sun moon horizon here we have big picture so i see you're seeing the bigger picture here your awareness is heightened like you're looking at the situation from all sides the bottom deck is a transformation is going to take place and a heart healing is going to take place. You're going to be open to this person and you're going to experience love and warmth with them. But you're going to follow your practical intuition to get there. Yeah, to this heart healing change. Yeah, a change is taking place, of course, with the transformation. But I'm definitely seeing like maybe your heart chakra was blocked in the past okay and then you just start having this understanding of everything happens for a reason and you started to be more content in your everyday life going with the flow for things with things being more appreciative and then this pre this presents itself i feel like you're going to allow it to take place let's throw some tarot on it what can we expect please and thank you Page of Pentacles. So maybe something doesn't... Um, I'm going to get one more if I say. Oh, with the death card. Ten of Swords. I just have to see something because... You may have gotten turned down or you may have turned this person down in the past. We'll delve deeper with the Nine of Swords and the Justice. Maybe you turned someone down in the past. Maybe being a little shallow. I'm not for certain if it's shallow or just shit. I don't know. You like what you like, but you kind of didn't really. You was kind of harsh to this person. You know, and you kind of ghosted them in a way too. And you're like, please don't let that hold me back from this because I really want this. I really want to go with the flow with this. What else? Six of Swords. Yeah, I really want to um, move to the common waters. I want to be better shit, you know? I want to move from that negativity, that in and out energy with not... Um, being committal to people. It's like you want a commitment. Yeah, with the Three of Pentacles here. You want to move towards commitment with the Knight of Pentacles. Okay, so you're in a masculine energy right now. You're action-oriented, okay? Um, towards stability with this person and towards... Um, more of a higher commitment like more stability and commitment okay yeah with the queen of swords in reverse and the tower you definitely uh left a toxic situation in the past for sure for sure this person could have as well here we have yeah the empress so Now someone comes in that's worthy of, now someone comes in that's worthy of this um, love and admiration that you would want to give to someone, okay? It's like, this person could be a male and they're coming in as the empress. They're worthy in this situation. They are worthy of affection from you okay this person too was in a situation where they weren't getting enough love okay it's letting me know that this but this is an empress how is this empress not getting enough love they're 
you know, uh, supposed to. It's their divine right with the Ten of Wands here. I feel like a blockage could be allowing, you know. See, what it really may be is you may be the person kind of going with the flow more. You're the one who is showing this person how to open up because you've done it before. This person may not want to be a burden towards you with the chariot. They they may fear that you may move on because they still... Um, it's like they're going slow too. Like they have not really insecurities, but they don't want you to move forward. Like, because they're not moving fast enough. But the thing about it is, is you're a go with the flow type of person. You've learned through lessons already to go with the flow with things. You're not rushing things anyway. So it's like y'all are perfect for each other. With the queen of wands here, this person could be very passionate about you with the ten of cups. This person is going to be very passionate about you and they're going to fight to be with you. So I just want you to be mindful of that. Um, I feel like this person feels like you really treat them good already, like through the door. It's like some type of connection that the two of you have. With the King of Swords here, though, I feel like you're very upfront and this person may like that because they don't have to guess with you. Yeah, with the Two of Pentacles, they don't have to guess if you're wishy-washy, if you're in or you're out. I feel like you're very straightforward and you give that to this person as a gift almost, you know, so that they can know that, you know, there is stability with you, okay? I feel like you very well could be a female watching this. Some of you, though, may just be in this... Um, energy of action orientedness like masculine yang so you're a male but you don't always have to be a male okay you can be a female we duality has it where it balances out both energies okay but i feel like for majority of you you may be a woman in this masculine energy and this may be a man in the emperor's energy so smash that like button to let me know if that's the case. Um, the bottom deck is Page of Swords studying the situation overall to see how you want to come in, but not wanting to come in so naively, okay, because of past mistakes, okay, that didn't pan out with the Seven of Cups, like that limited you in some type of way. Yeah, with the Magician, there's an energy of manifesting um, a situation, manifesting a relationship and i feel like you're definitely doing that during this time period during the weekend of valentine's day valentine's day and beyond okay so expect to have someone um you could either be within the relationship or uh a situation with this person already and you're going with the you're going with the flow because you naturally go with the flow and they're really liking that low key and there's a lot of understanding here because it's like you've learned the lessons already that this person needs to learn okay or it's like two different perspectives that you can really learn something from everyone right and i feel like this person is going to compliment you well and you with them and i feel like you're going to go forward during that time so if this message resonated with you, smash that like button. And if you want to see more reads like this one, smash that like button. Thank you for all your love and support to this channel. Until then, peace and love.